So I know this is a Pokemon investing channel, but when I make my videos, I really try to be as neutral as possible and just transparent with you guys with what I'm doing to not try to push a false narrative. Now, if you go back to my channel, I have made some videos where they are pretty clickbaity and maybe misleading. So I apologize for those, but I really try to be neutral, especially now. Um, but one thing I've noticed, and this is not to point fingers at anyone or be negative, but some of these investing channels, I will caution you, um, and it could be mine, I could be like this, um, you could you know, say that I'm doing the same thing, which, fair enough, but I've noticed specifically some of these channels who make these specific videos it are pretty misleading, and I want you, I'm just making this video just to inform you guys to be careful with whose advice you take, because I see the comments of some of these videos, and people seem to be following them, and... They might have some good points with what they're saying, oh, maybe this is a good pickup or whatever, but specifically one topic in Pokemon investing I don't agree with is people who make videos about investing into certain cards. I feel like that is the most misleading part of Pokemon investing because everyone knows that a sealed booster box right now, you buy it, you hold on to it for three years, it's, it's going to go up in value, most likely, right? Everyone kind of knows that there's no argument with that. So I feel like channels where, you know, they usually just talk about sealed product and they're just saying, oh, this booster box is going up or down, or they're just telling you what they're buying. I feel like that's what I kind of do. Um, I feel like that's fine, because that's not really misleading anyone. Like, I'm just telling you guys what, what I plan on buying, and I show you guys the receipts, so I'm really doing it. But other than that, these channels that are telling you to buy certain cards, um, they're undervalued, they're going to go up in value. That is kind of, I think, where I kind of draw the line where, okay, that's misleading. I have not made a single video on this channel saying to buy a certain card. I've never done that. And I've even made videos in the past saying that this is, you know, the part of Pokemon investing I don't agree with because it's very misleading in my opinion. So like I said, I'm not going to point any fingers towards any channels, um, but I just wanted to make this video to caution you guys that when you watch these channels just to be careful and just use your own judgment because these people don't know anything, right? Yes, they can maybe say that a certain card maybe is undervalued because let's say competitive play or whatever, but other than that, Cards are not sealed product. Sealed product gets open, supply goes down, demand usually, if, even if it doesn't go up, you know, demand is going to be there. So that you can pretty much say that, okay, sealed product is like kind of, you know, different from cards because cards, there's always going to be packs getting open, right? So there's always going to be more supply of a single card into the market. And cards, I'll, we all know, you know, there's a lot of hype around certain cards. There's, you know, um, there's not like a finite, like, well, there is a finite amount of cards, but cards are always getting pushed into the market. And I feel like a lot of cards are way more prone to being pumped and dumped than sealed product. Um, and I feel like these videos that talk about investing into certain cards really doesn't help. Um, so I'm just going to scroll through, you know, these, uh, videos. I'm not going to point any single channel out, but just look at these titles and you can watch these videos for yourself. But yeah, these are videos do very well um i've never made i could make videos like this and pull a lot of views but i don't do it because it's i find it to be very misleading and dishonest and disingenuous because these people most likely are making their they might ha not have you know bad intentions but i feel like they're you know maybe not thinking about the negatives of you know people are actually following my advice they're spending money and yeah, you can just see for yourself, these videos pull so many views. I can make videos like these, but I'm not going to because I really don't believe in it. So just going to scroll through, not going to, you know, point out anything. But um, just any channels that you see here that are kind of, you know, saying to buy a certain cards. You see in the thumbnails that all of these cards are going to go up in value and buy this now and all this stuff. Um, yeah, you can watch these videos for yourself, but just use caution when, watch when, you know, watching these videos and, you know, taking these people's advice. Um, so yeah, I mean, I'm not going to go scroll like forever, but yeah, just some people out there I would be careful of. Um, so yeah, just a quick video. Just wanted to say to be careful and you know, maybe my channel you have to be careful of. Maybe I'm pushing a bad narrative too, but, um, yeah, just wanted to, I think just make this video just to tell you guys that, you know, not everyone out there, um, I feel like is being, you know, I guess thoughtful of what the videos they're making are really doing. So yeah. That's the end of this video. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.